Good morning everyone. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to another unedited vlog. It is Thursday and I have a fun day planned for you guys. We're starting the morning off together. I'm going to take my little supplements that I take in the morning. I'm feeling a little bit tired. <sighs> Just a little bit, but we're good. We're going to tell the story on the podcast. So if you listen to Agamel, that Long story short, Zane went out last night to Brooklyn Mirage with his friends and his brother and his cousin and he had way too much to drink. So me and Jerry had to go save them all the way in Brooklyn at one o'clock in the morning. We didn't get back until 3 a.m. So I lost a little bit of sleep, but he's fine now. He's recovering in bed and I think he um, is now never going to do that again. I've had those moments, so I understand how he feels. He's like, thank you so much, babe, I'm sorry. I was like, it's fine, you're out with your friends. Sometimes you get carried away. The good thing is you didn't drive home, so no problem, we got you. So that's what happened. That one was impressive, you can't lie. Let's see if we can do it again. No face. Look at me go, I'm getting used to taking big pills. Um, okay, so. We're doing a little bit of a morning routine and it's 8.23 a.m. And mom's gonna come get me at nine. And she told me like a few weeks ago now, she's like, when it gets nice out, I wanna go with you and get all the plants for your backyard and set it up nice. And I was like, sign me up because that is not like a project that I would wanna do alone. The cats are fighting. So I took her up on her offer. I texted her yesterday and I was like, are you free tomorrow? Do you want to go do like the plant stuff? It's been cloudy, rainy, not very nice out. And it's like, I feel like June should be like hot, like summer weather. I mean, it's summer in a few days. So hopefully that'll play a factor, but um, it is going to rain the next two days. But I'm like, it's fine. The plants will get water, you know, and hopefully the sunshine will come now. But we're going to go to Walmart, get some plants. And then also I'm going to try that viral smashed taco recipe. So while we're at Walmart, I have like pretty much everything for it. I don't think I'm going to do the Big Mac sauce. Honestly, I'm more like a ketchup and mayo kind of gal. Or just got this sauce from Walmart and I feel like I want to try it. This cilantro lime sauce, which is more of like a traditional taco sauce. I feel like not like a hamburger taco sauce. If you don't know what I'm talking about. Um, it's gone viral recently where you like take hamburger meat and you like smash it down with a tortilla and then you like eat it like a taco and put all like burger toppings in it. So I guess if I wanted to go more traditional, I would do like a burger sauce, not like a cilantro lime sauce, not traditional, like on the burger theme, not like authentic taco. Do you know what I mean? Anyway, so we're gonna try that out on the Blackstone. It should be really nice out today. It was supposed to be 80 and sunny. Now it's looking like 70 something and cloudy. So we'll see where the day brings us. But even if the sun peeps through, that's fine. So we'll go get the plants, go get that stuff for food. And then we're gonna like sit by the pool and hang. We have to um, finalize some plans for my sister's bridal shower. She's having one in Texas, one in New York. And the one in New York is at Mikasa. So we need to like look outside, see what we wanna do with like tables, decor. All of those types of things. We already know what kind of food we want to get. Invites are obviously already out. It's in July. Um, but maybe like order some decorations and a balloon arch and stuff. So that is that. Um, trying to find my, here it is. My antibiotics for my cyst, which is almost pretty much gone. Thank goodness. And I've been like religiously taking these and putting the hot compress on it. So, mm -mm. like a little baby. There we go. Um, so yeah, it's gonna be a fun day. A nice summery day. We'll get plants, we'll cook. It's gonna be fun. But before my mom comes and gets me, I have a few things to do. I've got my to-do list in front of me. We can check off probiotic, antibiotics, cranberry. Um, And then birth control is in like 30 minutes. I have to go do some computer work. I have to finish the podcast notes from yesterday. I never got around to it. I have to answer some emails. 
post some pictures on Instagram. And then I'm gonna get myself a little bit ready. I think I'm gonna put on like a little bit of like a tinted moisturizer or like a CC cream that has SPF in it. Just to feel a little more put together. I washed my hair yesterday and I Dyson air wrapped it. The curls don't like really stay overnight unless you like sleep a certain way and I did not so but I don't know what that way is like do I just have to hairspray them a lot I don't know but either way it just looks like an actual blowout I just have to brush through it and it'll look good so at least I styled it this time when I actually get like natural and look like a frizzy mess I don't feel put together so I already feel like better like this and it makes me want to put on just a little something to feel good for the day so let's get it going I've already been talking for almost six minutes and this is unedited so that adds up so fast Let's continue. <laughs> All right. Next is the podcast notes. We did a spicy episode yesterday about spicy things in the bedroom. And I may have gone a little TMI. So if you want to hear that side of me, <laughs> go check out that episode. It comes out on June 22nd. Cats are arguing. So basically we have a shared note and I just go in there and... I'll put the title, I'll put the description, and then once Jerry edits the episode and puts it up onto our platform, she can just put that right in there. It's already ready for her. So um, I usually do it the day we record, but yesterday I had to go do something right after we were done. So I got like distracted, um, but yeah. So I'm gonna do that. <laughs> All right, this face needs some love and my eyes, I actually should probably put in eye drops before I even begin, huh? Okay, one sec. <laughs> okay, I was just trying to say that my eyes are so itchy. And I have like this like bruised feeling right here, which I assume is like an allergy thing. I know the itchy eyes is like an allergy thing. But since I got LASIK, I've been like almost kind of freaking myself out. Because you're supposed to use these little like eye drop things after you open them within 24 hours. And there's definitely been days lately where... The next morning i put in eye drops and they're from you know the day before like a little after 24 hours or whatever so i'm like oh my god did i give myself an infection by using like eye drops that have like bacteria in them but you put a little cap on them so i don't think that that would have caused anything under here but i think it's like an allergy thing i've never had like itchy eye allergy symptoms oh this is so good <laughs> So I don't know what it feels like, but I explained it to Zane's mom the other day and she was like, that sounds like allergies, just like that bruised feeling of like your sinuses right here. But my eyes have been so itchy. I don't know. Anyways, um, just putting on some skincare. <laughs> that's, all, that's all I've got. Hi, Benj. Good morning. Okay. He looked over. Good morning. This is my favorite eye cream. Look at like how awake it makes you look just opens up your eyes it's the Kiehl's creamy eye treatment with avocado 10 out of 10 we gotta put on our jewelry too make sure I do that um, yeah that's it let's do our brows I got these off of Amazon so like see how it gets like gooky from eye gel um, I found that if you use a brush too much, then that just like makes your brows not good. And then you get like a residue, like a white residue. So I use the disposables, but I use them a good amount of times before I actually throw them out. But I got like a giant pack off of Amazon. My chest is gurgling. <laughs> if you know, you know. I got a giant pack of them off Amazon, so it's going to last me forever. Just snatching up the brows. I need to get some natural tan on this face. I've been wearing like sunglasses and my hat. So I've gotten like zero color on my face. That would be nice today for me planting and stuff. I gotta go in the backyard too before she gets here. Oh, actually, when she gets here, I'm gonna have her come in the backyard because there's we have like a few bags of soil that the previous owners left and I wanna assess what we need, what we want before we just go like aimlessly by. So we'll do that too. I want some nice palm tree leaves and some like little flowers for the garden, but nothing crazy because I don't have a green thumb at all. So they need to be like very minimal upkeep type of plants. 
Okay, so I'm gonna finish this. I'm gonna put on some Tula filter primer and then just a very, very light layer of this um, Bye Bye foundation. Um, it has SPF 50 in it. It's a full coverage moisturizer. It's called Bye Bye Foundation, but it's a full coverage moisturizer. So I'm just gonna do a nice light layer on the face, low mascara, and probably call it there. <laughs> okay, I lied. Just filling you guys in because I look like a flat nothing with just um, I have a piece of fuzz on my face. A flat nothing with just the tinted moisturizer. So a little bit of concealer because <laughs> got a little bit dark under my eyes. So, blend that in, and then I am just going to keep it to all cream products, since we're going to be, like, outside in the sun and stuff. So, just a little bit of contour here, just so I don't look so super flat. And then I'll probably do a little bit of liquid blush, and then mascara, and we'll be done. It's already 8.59. How did that happen? <laughs> I'm just alive. It's okay if I know my mom. She's just like me. And she's going to run a little bit late. <laughs> Probably didn't even leave her house yet. So, Oh, like so much better. I needed some color back in the face. Yes. Oh. Okay, it's birth control time. But real quick, I was just going to show you this Anastasia blush stick. Perfect when you're just like quick in a rush. It's got the little blush on this side and then the little um, thing to, the little brush to blend it. I go all like across my face because I saw somewhere that, what's with the fuzz? Oh, there it is. <laughs> I saw somewhere that it makes you look like a little sun-kissed glow and I like it. Perfect. Like, that's a pretty base. Now all we need is a little mascara to finish it up. I love you, Picasso. Okay. Birth control. They're so tiny. I get nervous that it's going to get stuck in my straw. Anyone else? Like, it's so little. I put it under my tongue so it doesn't go in my, in my drink. probably not even working because I'm on antibiotics but we're gonna stay in the habit getting used to that okay and just a little bit of scara bring the whole thing together I got it on my eyelid of course I did of course I'm so excited that we're getting out early we were like, let's enjoy the day by the pool. Let's go nice and early instead of waiting until like freaking 12 o'clock. Come back and plan. We'll make a nice lunch. It'll be good. All right, good. Um, I do need some chapstick, but that is not here. So that will be in a second. But quick, quick little vibe. And I have mascara on my eyelid cute i feel a little more put together for the day all right i'm gonna put on my jewelry get into a little errands outfit probably just some like biker shorts and stuff and oh yeah something that i can plant in so i'll wear biker shorts and a little tank top and then well we'll go i'll show you guys when i get dressed i feel like unedited vlogs are so like calming where it's like edits and this and that not that I'm like that kind of YouTuber anyways, but I just feel like an unedited vlog makes me feel like relaxed. I can just chat with you guys. It's chill, you know? All right, we're dressed. Putting on a scented perfume. Delicioso. Here's the fit. Fabletics biker shorts, little white fox uh, tank top, Lulu bag, my Amazon sunnies, then I'm probably just gonna wear Burks. Um, and we got on little smiley face earrings. Looking cute. I need to wipe this 
CC cream off of my lips and put on chapstick that is desperately needed right now. Actually, I'm gonna put on this. I got this on Amazon. I've seen it before. It looks like a very familiar bottle to me, but I've never owned it. But I wanted to get some sort of lip product that had an SPF in it because I feel like when I sit outside, my lips get like burnt or like trapped. So I got this using you guys as a mirror. And it's, it is nice and hydrating. And I feel like it's been working. Like my lips are not like burning all the time. Just so dry. So that's my lip product of choice. Also, this is kind of like my first time vlogging this week. It was kind of just like a mundane week of just like computer stuff and whatever. I didn't want to bore you guys, but I did get my nails done. I don't know how I feel about them. I was excited to do the yellow and then I was like hesitant about it. I felt that chunk. Um, I was excited to do, I did like yellow chrome. And then I was like, I better pick the right yellow. And I don't know if I picked the right yellow. I think it might be a little too bright. Maybe I wanted more of a pastel. I can't tell, but it is what it is. It's temporary, it doesn't matter, but yeah. We have yellow nails, summer vibes. Um, what else did you miss? I went to a concert with my parents. It was uh, Sean Kingston, En Vogue, TLC, and Shaggy. All throwbacks. It was actually a lot of fun at Jones Beach on Long Island. Um, it was a fun time and it was kind of nice to just like disconnect and just go and enjoy spending time with my parents um and that's that i reading update well, let's see where did i leave you guys off i don't remember i finished confess no no without merit i finished confess a while ago i read confess that was good um and then it wasn't my favorite book of hers but it was good without merit i think that's one of my favorite book of colleen hoover's it was so good I loved it like top five for sure and right now I'm reading um heart bones because I've heard a lot of good things about it I'm like easing slowly easing into it I'm like almost halfway done um it's like good but so far not like my favorite but sometimes when I read the second half of the book my opinion changes so I'll let you guys know how that one goes but I'm almost done with coho we're doing good so all right now I'm just gonna wait for mom and probably get a few more little things done in the meantime but yeah I'm just gonna wait for mom and then we're gonna have some fun I lost my train of thought okay good she's not coming yeah Hi, when you get here, you want to just come to the backyard quick so we can assess what we even want? Yeah, because I want to bring my bag in anyway so we have more room in the car. You okay. All right. Be there in the field. Okay, sounds good. Okay. All right, bye. bye. Okay, she's coming. <laughs> oh, also, I remember something else you guys missed. We got the cat's nails cut yesterday. You guys know the guy, Matt, that we have that comes to the house. And we did it right here, and we thought, oh, let's, like, close off the room so they don't run and hide under the bed and stuff. I think it made them extra nervous. It was so difficult yesterday. Like, we were all day, Zane and I were making jokes to them. We are like, you were so bad today. We were like, you were mean, and you were not nice to Matt. That is your friend. <laughs> but so dramatic. Like, they're not getting anything done. They're just getting their nails cut. But they were like hissing and like trying to get out of our arms and we were wrapping them in a towel because it's supposed to help like comfort them but we got the job done so i need to clean up in here never did that i'm gonna do a little quick vacuum get all their little nail clippings out um we also started with benji and he's quite vocal so i feel like next time we should start with bella or bailey because i think also they heard benji meowing benji just goes meow, meow. it's so funny um and then Bella was just like hissing, trying to get out of my arms. Bailey was hissing. It was a time, but they needed their nails cut really bad. And it's much better than having to put all three of them in a cage and bring them somewhere. He just comes to the house, so like 10 out of 10. But I'm gonna clean up after that. I have their towel, put it in the laundry. Um, yeah, but what you missed on my channel while I was gone. <laughs> All right, mom is here. We're gonna go assess the backyard, see what we do and don't need. Oh no. What? Or Nori. I know. I'm just, just gonna need a it. new table. Yeah. Just spray it again. Yeah, just keep spraying it. 
All right. Pool looks nice. Oh, we're gonna be sitting here later. Pool's looking good. Oh yeah, we're having a pool day for sure. Yeah, pool's looking much better. We got it back from the cloudiness. So we have this little area. These keep popping up. Okay. They keep going away and popping up. We need to mulch. These are um, these are lilies. I have them. Uh -huh. They're orange, but they die. Yeah. Yeah. Really Which quick. Al, daddy loves that. But uh -huh. I I like to I like to get new flowers every year. Put my hands yeah. in the dirt. Good for you. I'm We're gonna with, need to I'm buy gloves. With nature. Okay, we need yes. to buy gloves. I have plastic at home, but I forgot. Oh, I have like these are. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. Like unedited. Feel it? Hear unedited. It? I warned mom. I was like, I'm doing unedited. <laughs> yeah, they do. All the, the garbage. Finger. Put them in the garbage right there. Um, well, I have some veggies. Okay. Yeah. Some like herbs and vegetables. Yeah. I think herbs. Veggies yeah. are hard for me no. because I feel like they don't grow do, like, a lot basil of them. Basil and that shit. Yeah, like okay. basil stuff like all right, that. So we need mold. Down for are that. Are you making a list? Okay. In my head for right now. Um, I left this one out in the rain yesterday, so... Oh, this one? Yeah. I, I'll sit on it, it's fine. Um, yeah, so I think mulch, some flowers... Well, wait, can we use... Wait, bring the here Wait, can we use the blue gloves or no? I have those. Like the I blue... I my house because I have ones... The blue ones make my hands like sticky and wet and it's gross. Oh, okay. But I have, like, we need more like cotton. Oh, dad has a million gloves. Yes. But oh, we're stealing from him. I'm plastic underneath. Okay. Because I don't want to get dirty Understood. Nails. Okay. What are you showing me? So. <laughs> <laughs> what? Okay, what is this? How What's wrong? plants are then? <laughs> What's Oh, they weed whacked them. No. <laughs> the landscapers they weed whacked them off? They, they were there? Oh. Fake plant. oh, wait. What's this? That's a fake plant. See how they turn like blue, kind of? Well, I use I get flowers, so I don't use this yeah. one. They don't really do that. Yeah. But yeah, this one is. I mean, we can yeah. still use it if you want, but yeah, we'll put real plants in there. Yeah. You can put one there, one on the edge. I would love to do like here. pastas, like something that's easy. Pastas, yeah. Is we'll that a good idea? Like every year, you don't want flowers then. Yeah, I do want sunflowers. Okay. Right. But sunflowers. Some, some. I mean, sunflowers are pretty. <laughs> something that is easily. Keep upable because dad. I don't have a green thumb. Neither do I. That's why I'm sticking to just the herbs because I tried veggies and you have to be very, I feel like, on top of it and yeah. to get a lot, Pastas, you know? You could run over with a truck and Pastas come back. will come back. Um, and then maybe some, you know, color in here. Yeah, something in that pot. That's it, right? No, I want big, big ones. We have this one to fill. Oh, you want the yeah, three of them. I have two of two planters out front too that we could bring back. Um, look at this dirt. I have dirt under here. Soil. I don't know. That was left from the previous owners. What? It's probably like garbage now, right? I don't know. What the heck is under here? What is that cool salt? Thing? Oh. Wait a minute. There's a, t a tomato thing. Wait, what is that salt? That's pool salt. That's it's an empty bag. Yeah. Oh, okay. It flew over there. Wait, yeah, do you see the tomato plant? Yeah. No. It's, it's just so store. much work. Should I just buy them from the store? Yeah, do we have the herbs I like. Get in what? There and feel that bag if it's mushy. Okay. Oh, I think that's like for tomatoes plants. Okay. I don't think that's regular soil. Unedited. Ugh. I got wet. Bugs. Ugh. I don't have gloves on yet. We can ask the landscaper to get rid oh, of it for you. Oh, it looks fine. Yeah. Well, okay. Good. The landscapers might come today. They usually come today or tomorrow. Oh, I gotta send him a note because I left his payment. In the okay. So I think those two are good. We have some soil. So we need like how many bags of mulch you think? Or should we even do mulch? Can we just do I dirt? Mean, the dirt is pretty I mean we could get we could get um you know potting soil. That that's black. Little, that's what this is. Good. Raised bed yeah. oh raised bed soil. This yeah. is for this. Um, Understood. Okay. I would put a palm tree in the over there. there. I said that too. <laughs> Maybe yeah. this one. Yeah. This is the one you go at that store? Yeah. I wanna bring dad there. Yeah. One day when it's he's fun. Old. Okay, so we have three big plants and then a bunch of little ones, some hostas, and maybe like two bags of mulch. More than two, probably. Oh, you want the mulch now. I don't know, what do you think? Yeah, I would get like. The, like black? Yeah. Black mulch? Yeah. Okay. okay. And then we'll get the stuff for our lunch. Oh, you eat that too? See, there's not even that much. We'll be done in no time. It's two little areas. Up there. Yeah. Well, I have three pots, so we'll keep one in the corner down there. We'll put one up there, and then we'll put one down here somewhere. And we have that, we have these two, three little pots. All right, I'm going to make a note on my phone. Three little pots. Okay. Three little pots, three big pots, and two beds we have. Okay. Okay. On it. I got to wash this towel. Okay. I know. 
Honestly, these candles were left by the previous owners in the shed. <laughs> Yeah, what, I just they, think they look pretty, but I'll get, pretty let's cute. get new ones today, I too. Sauce when I, came I know, you did think there was sauce. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. You should get a little rug for here. I should, huh? Yeah. Yeah. You, you know, All right, add it to the list. <laughs> add it to the list. Okay, mom has convinced me to make the Big Mac sauce. She's like, just make it. I actually have everything else except for the relish, so. Do you need these for yourself? Oh, I have a giant jar in the fridge. So I have everything else to make the sauce, we just need the relish. Maybe I like relish. I don't think I've ever really tried it. Really? Yeah. Oh, relish is the bomb. Sounds good. Okay. I, I always have them on my um, hot dog, but I don't eat hot yeah. dogs anymore. I love hot dogs. Okay, and then we need beef and tortillas on it. Everything else we have at home. Okay, next we're gonna get beef. I was gonna use turkey meat, but I'm like, mm, that's not gonna give us like the hamburger flavor that we're going for. And if we're gonna try it, the trends, we might as well go for it, you know? I feel like I should get the bigger one because Zane's probably gonna have some. He's hungover. He's gonna he want these. Do you think he has a hangover? <laughs> he might have a hangover. Oh Got it. All right. Beautiful. Now tortillas. Okay, tortilla time. I was gonna use corn tortillas because we have those at home, but then I realized all the recipes I'm seeing are um, flour. So I'll probably use these carb balanced tortillas. I like these. These are good. Perfect size too. Okay, getting a little distracted, but I think I'm gonna get these for Zane. I feel like he would really like these like linen shorts. Let's see, but I don't know what size, medium 32 to 34. I feel like that's right. Yeah, I think he'll like these. He's in his like linen uh, cool boy era, or people are calling it like old school, old school fashion. Old money, old money aesthetic. That's what he said it's called. I don't know if he'll dig with the, the tie on top, but he can tuck it. Yeah, he can always return. I feel like maybe he'll like this. Getting him a present. <laughs> okay, I think we found a doormat for the back porch. So when you come in from the back porch, you have something to wipe your feet on. I don't know if I'm gonna like that one there, but we'll see. I'm gonna slide it in here. We're keeping room for our plants. We'll move those clothes, but are you getting distracted? I do need a rug for the living room, but I don't really know what size. I'll do that online. Okay, first things first, we definitely want the hostas. Is that a good price? Yes. How okay, many do you 17 bucks. I don't know how many do you think. Maybe like three? They get big, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay, we'll do three in that section. The other one, we'll just do flowers. But hostas, we should put in that other section. You gotta pick good ones now. We should pick ones that are already big, right? Like, I think this one's good. This one? Yeah, you think? Yeah. I like that one. We can actually dad can Let me them up. I'm gonna move these so they don't get dirty. Okay. Um, and then maybe this one? Or no? Because it's a little brown. What do we think? Well, this one's nice. Yeah? Okay, hold on. Let me put them down. How's that? I don't know. Unedited. Here we are. Cute. And then one more. This one nice? I should've got a cart too, huh? This one's nice? Yeah. Okay. They'll grow. Yeah. Okay, cool. Hostas, check. The pot? I love these. It's a fern. A fern. Feels love quite, it. Feels fake, right? How do I take care of it? Um, part sun. Good for along fences, along walls or buildings, annuals. That means they come back? No. Oh. You would think because it's annually. Oh, no, it's once, opposite. Once a year. Yeah. But if you keep it alive, you can bring it inside. Oh, I don't know about all that. <laughs> Put it in the basement. Uh, all right, let's skip on that for now. <laughs> okay, now for flowers, I'm thinking like orange and white would look nice. Nice little summer pop. I like those, Mom. Like Those yellow. are pretty too. I like yellow. I would like yellow, orange kind of family. Maybe a little bit of pink? Feeling frisky? I don't know. I don't know. You tell me. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> okay. I trust you. Okay. I like these too. White with these colors. I like that. I think I actually like the pink too. Low you key. Do? Low key. Yeah. It's kind of tropical. They have no palm trees here. I'll have to go somewhere else for those. Good look. Want to get one of these in a white? And I'll mix them. 
Okay. Put it in the part. In the, in the part. In the cart. In the part. Okay. We're gonna be very colorful. The black pot, what are you putting in there? Okay. Flowers? Um. Maybe, we'll, let's just stick with one pink. We'll put one pink in a, like a, one of the little pots. Uh -huh. And then in the garden, I think we should do orange, yellow, and white. Yeah, let's do those. Those would look nice with these. Look at this one. Yeah, very pretty. I think we should get two of these. Two? I think so. I feel like this is nothing. This is so this is not gonna feel nothing, no? Yeah, but they're gonna grow. They're gonna grow, okay. More, you see all, look at this. Uh, will my landscapers water them for me? <laughs> Sprinklers will. Look, <laughs> I'm worried about them all dying. These are all flowers. Oh, okay. They have but to I only try to get some that are already out. Already so when you put it, yeah, and then they'll spud more. Okay. See, sure. see a good one. My Flowers are expensive. People do this every year. My goodness. I only put it. Well, Daddy bought me. Daddy bought me a flat. Here, see how many in here? Look at all these. These okay. are all gonna pop out. Okay. So we can put them in different pots. Right. Got it. Right. You got that nice orange up there too. Look at that one. That looks nice. Yeah, those are pretty too. I really, I think we should get another one of these. Which one? This the orange white? one. This orange one you talk about. This one. I love this with the white. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. What a gardener. Bounce. Okay, Look mom, mom says we're exchanging. Oh, that is pretty. Um, we're exchanging these hostas because these are $16. These are $8. And she said they're going to grow to that yeah. anyway. Yeah. So these are that. grow back every year. You should yes. have the same. Okay. You can run it over with a truck. Oh, all right. <laughs> okay, I'll take these out then. They never die. All right, I'm setting you guys up here on the cart. I also want one of these. So pretty. Which one? Which one? And what you have to do, the only thing you have to do, is when they die, pop them off and they'll regrow. And they're dead. Okay. Got it. Got it, Coach. She's on the move. <laughs> One more hosta. Oh, wait. Are those hostas too? These what? plain ones? Yeah. Oh, I like those. Better? Oh, no. We can mix it, right? Yeah. We'll get one. Or is that weird? With, are these different? Yeah, whatever you want. Is white stripe, this yellow stripe? Yeah, whatever you want. I like the white. Yeah, me too. Okay, so no yellow? I mean, you can mix them. You know, the white here. Yeah, I think white. You don't look too good though. Too oh, uh oh. <laughs> maybe two white, one plain. Maybe. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, success. It was only like a little over a hundred bucks for all the plants, so I feel that's pretty good. Let's hope I can keep them all alive. You got white, pink, costas, orange. I got the mat. I got the food. Zane shorts. Oh, I got this too. A little citronella candle. I'm just showing you now because when we get home, we're hungry. We're gonna cook. We have to stop at Lowe's. Got all these plants. I got basil, oregano. That's all that. Um, yeah. All right. Now we're gonna load the car, and then we're going to Lowe's to get the big boys. I need a big boy. Are oh, you putting them down now? Okay. Yeah. Got the car all packed up. Now we're at Home Depot. We're gonna get three palm trees, three big palm trees. Not palm trees, but like palm leaf plants, whatever. And then a little bit of soil, a little bit of mulch, and we're off home. We're getting hangry. Quickly, let's go. Okay, get some soil. Oh, now two. Look, they for those little Where's the sun? on there too then or I'll be too heavy okay we'll just get the plants now done yeah so I'm talking about oh there's even littler ones these are good how much 
Thirty dollars. Thirty dollars for one, huh? Thirty dollars each. I got them for twenty. I feel like last season, two seasons ago, last season. No, they're right here. The small ones. Thirty. How much the big ones? The big ones are um fifty. I'll just get three of the little, little ones. Ten dollars they went up. Ten dollars went up like eggs. Get one big one. Yeah. I don't know if it'll fit my car. Uh, it'll grow. It'll grow. It'll work fine. Okay. That's enough. I think I've spent enough money on things I'm gonna kill anyway. <laughs> all right, we got it all. Look at your mom. Go, girl. <laughs> Why is it not sunny? What's going on? Okay. I don't know how we did it, but we got them all in here. One of them has water seeping out of it. I just spilled it on my foot. Always an adventure with Alyssa. But yeah, we made it work. I spilled out most of the water in the parking lot. I tried to at least. All right, let's get home. It's unpacked. I'll have Zane help us bring everything in and we'll eat. Okay, our landscapers are here, so don't mind that background noise, but we put the rug down. Actually, I hated it at first. It's kind of growing on me. It's like, it is what it is. Well, maybe it'll go in the front of the house. It just doesn't match these browns. You can move it over just a little bit. Move it over? This whole thing. Oh, so it's not up against each other. It looks, keep it there. I think it looks cute. It's cute. Yeah. She, she's doing what she needs to do, I guess. Um, setting up over here, we brought everything back. Zane helped us bring everything back here. Um, we're gonna do that after we eat, but I have everything set up. I'm gonna film a reel. So I just chopped up onion, um, lettuce. We have the tortillas, the beef, and then all the seasonings and stuff. I'm gonna kind of do the sauce by like I. It's um, a mix of mayo, honey mustard, a bunch of seasonings, and then chopped up onion. And mom has over here pickle relish, sweet relish. Pickles? It is pickles, right? Relish? What is it? Cucumbers? Oh yeah, high fructose corn syrup, yum. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna do a little bit of that. I can link down below the real, sorry this is unedited. <laughs> I could link down below the reel and in the description of like the YouTube short and reel will be all the ingredients and everything for you guys. I'm not measuring the sauce though, so bear with me, you know? Update, I had the wrong mustard. Just wanted to tell you guys. What? Mom's talking to me at the same time I'm filming. What? I can't hear you. Hold on. <laughs> um, it was yellow mustard, not honey mustard. So I just swapped that out. And let's see if it looks accurate. We might need a little more paprika. I didn't have the vinegar and I didn't put sugar in it, but hopefully it's decent. Question mark? It looks good. Maybe just more paprika for color. Which is good. Hopefully it tastes good. <laughs> Are we rolling? We're rolling. Okay, hello everyone. I made my meat balls and we're gonna smush them down. We're gonna put them on and we're gonna smush them down and we're gonna season them. Quick. One, two. Three. What should I make? Four. <laughs> Five. <laughs> I'll start with six. Hopefully they come out good. Okay, now I can take my glove off. Bear with me, bear with me. It's like making a Season. Cool. Cool. Pepper. You just, you know. Onion powder, garlic powder, that's all we need, right? The Onion classics. powder, the classics. Come on. Maybe I could have smashed them first. Oh, it already smells good. It does? Yeah, really good. Okay. Garlic. All right, now. 
take your tortillas. Okay. Where's my musher? Oh, it's over there. Okay. Now you take this, and you go like this, and you go like this. That's how you do it. That, they're gonna be too close together. Move it over. What do we think? Clever. Okay, we can pause it now, and then I'll show them when we flip it. Okay. All right, we're back. Okay, sorry guys, I flipped those two without even realizing. I guess I didn't smash enough. It's my first time. We're learning. But it's supposed to cover like the whole perimeter, you know? But I guess that's why people mush it on the tortilla and then they slap it on. But I was trying to be the quick way. Put it on there and then mush. Right. But people take the meat and they... Yeah, look at that! Yeah, it looks good. People take the meat and they mush it on the edge and then they put it down. Are you able to lift it to see the other side or no? Like at the patty? Oh, you're worried about it not being cooked? Oh no! I'm not worried about it, I'm just curious. Hold on, we have a catastrophe happening. Pause. Live. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Party spaghetti. I should have prepped these actually, but now we're gonna put on good old American. Pop it right on there. Let it get all melty. Oh my god. Don't you want some of that? Oh yeah. You see my Big Mac sauce? You got Big Mac sauce? I need it, look. No way. <laughs> Isn't it just Thousand Island? That's what mom said. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's just Thousand Island. No, it's, I mixed mayo, relish. There's supposed to be vinegar, but you use it all to clean, so we don't have any more. And then, so I did pickle juice instead. Hopefully that didn't ruin it. Mm. I'm pretty sure Shake Shell, uh, Shake Sauce uses pickle juice. Okay. Like there pickle, was also like Chick-fil-A sauce whatever. at the store too. I was like, oh, I could've just bought that. Mm. Look it, cute, right? Oh yeah. All right, up close and personal, I'll show you guys how I put them on the little taco holders. And then you gotta like push it down. I might have made them a little extra crispy, but it's fine. That's just the way mom likes it. Yeah. Yeah, that works. Look at that. Amazing. Now we put the toppings on. Okay. I hate mine right now. We're topping some onion. Some extra relish. Some lettuce. Can you open the pickles, babe? Some lettuce. That's what it is. Pickles. Check our fork for this. And the sauce. <laughs> okay. It's a terrible unedited clip. They're me so bored. Huh. It does look pretty good, the sauce, huh? It smells just like it. Really? Yeah. I don't really get Big Macs, so I don't know. I've gotten it once, actually, for a video, remember? Did you? Yeah. Okay, dig in everyone. All your toppings on. All right, how do you do this? Okay, everyone's taste testing. Oh, they're biting. I'm you nervous. Bite oh god. Mmm. That mm. sauce is really good. Can't put enough on there. Mmm. Mmm. Yo, wait. Let me try a little. Dippage. <laughs> a little dab of that right here. Mmm. Oh, good. Very easy. Mmm. <clears throat> I would say just getting more seasonings. Maybe. Mmm. I love that. I'll put some more relish on top, actually, maybe. Oh. Good. Okay, 
lunch was so fire flames and they were quite easy and simple and we have leftover ingredients and leftover tacos for later so that was great um and now we're starting to garden i think we lost zane he was bringing back these these planters we had two of these in the front from our apartment and he's only brought back one i gotta make sure he didn't oh no ma they're both here that's why he's not here <laughs> oh you're putting down dirt already no, I'm just oh moving it oh it looks fresh what? What? Concentrate on that. <laughs> what? Oh, you don't have your camera? You look so cute! That's adorable. Thanks. Um, so over oh, here... This? this? What? No. Okay, it's garbage. It's fine. Okay. This? She's like, you've had enough. I can't believe the landscapers did this. Come on. I don't know. Maybe they did. Maybe the rabbits tried to eat I don't know. It. I thought it was real. But look, I'm doing it already. Okay? Yeah. We don't have a rake. We're working with what we got. A snow shovel. I need to see the little shovel you have, because I'm going to need it for the pots. Okay. So over here, we're going to do hostas and what? Pink? Pastas and some flowers. Pastas and I think we should do the orange and yellow ones over here because I want to see them more. Yeah, if you want to be able to look at them. Yeah, the when I lay by the pool, yeah. The pink we can put over here. I don't know. It doesn't, I guess it doesn't really matter. Um, oh, I'm trying to find her a little shovel. Do I have that? Oh, I have a mini rake and a mini shovel. Look, I'm prepared. There we go. That is, you're not going to be able to move that. That's heavy. Okay, here. What are we putting in here? That's going to be all three big ones or the palm trees. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't know how we're going to get in there, though. Oh, she's, you're a gardener. This is very crafty of you. Well, you are crafty, but like, it's, um, like, laborious. I feel like you'd be like, I'm not doing that. <laughs> yeah, maybe later. <laughs> All right, let's do that last. Okay. <laughs> now, in these, you want those packed flowers. In these, we should do the little flowers. But I think that we should focus on the gardens first. Yeah. And then, yeah. No? Whatever. It's the same I think, shit. Okay, same shit. <laughs> that one's going to look so nice over there. So this pot is going to go over there with that one. And then we'll put one of the ba these gray pots up on the deck with this one in it. Which one? I think that the gray pot should go in there with up there. Okay, and then that one. This one will there. go in the back corner. I'll bring it over there. Yeah. Okay, mom wants to see what this is gonna look like. Beautiful. You like so it? We're gonna put these. We can put them I around the pool. You. you know. You asked me to put it in there. What? You asked me to put it in there. I like it. Yeah. It needs to be higher, so we'll put yeah. a lot of dirt. We'll put dirt in. All right. Like this. It'd be like up here. Yes. Yeah. Okay. okay. Alright, so you want these in here? But don't you think we should fill the side things first and then worry about those? I think we have enough. Okay. I'm just gonna put one. Okay. Because they're gonna flourish, you know? Sure. Yeah. I love put it on here. Sure, yeah. Cute. Okay. Alright. Rolling. Look at us go. Eh? Hey. Oh, a little flower. It's a flower. Well, I Alyssa promises got... people that she's gonna. She's I gotta gonna, water them. She's gonna tend to her garden. I'm gonna yeah. remind her. I have to. Because this is where I stop. <laughs> see? You're not gonna come over every two days and water sure, them? Sure, I would if you wanted me to. Look, see, there's your little baby right there. Oh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just one, because mom said then they're gonna. Bloom. Yeah, and this way you can get them all over the place. Yeah. And I'll put some in there. Yeah. I think we bought way too much dirt. Yeah, you can never have too much dirt. If you return. Plus, we got. Don't no, excuse me. You have to fill up that big pot over there. Oh, true. You can't yeah, just that's put why that I got in there. Them, yeah. yeah. Probably need like two bags. You only got one. That. I got three. Where's the rest of them? I don't know. Zane put them. Oh, right here. Okay. Oh. Yeah. A little party. I need this. Yeah. A little more on this side. There we go. Okay. I'm gonna put this in the ground. I don't think there's anything in it at all. <laughs> over here. Over here. Make it nice and big. No, we should close. I'm so glad you like wanted to do this with me. I'm like, I'm taking her up on her offer because you were like, oh, when you're ready, let's go do the plants. Because I would hate to do this alone. I said to dad yesterday, I promised to listen and she took me up on it. I did. <laughs> Good? Or more? Good. Okay. So we here for now. Okay. Just for now. Oh, this, this glove method is good because I can take my hand out and touch my camera. See? <laughs> yeah. Check it out, guys. <laughs> but I only have two of them. Oh, well, it looks all right. I'm just looking for now. Just, just for now. I'm going to move it around. I, I, I got to see from a distance. Yeah. It's so cute. 
Are you sure it's gonna flourish and fill the pot? What? Are you sure they're gonna make more flowers? Yes, I'm positive. Okay. You'll see in about, I'm gonna say maybe I a think, week and a half. I think we should do one here and one on the other side of the steps. That's a like good idea. across from each other. Yeah. You like oh, that? Right next to the ladder. Yeah. Like yeah, that. oh, one on each side of the ladder? Yeah. That would be cute. Yeah, that would be different. All right, for now. I got, I got work. We got, we're trying to figure everything out. <laughs> and what are we doing in the white one? We wanna do the white and the- And the big, this one. That in what? The orange one, in the white. All by itself? Yeah, no? I thought that's cute. I just don't know where I want to put it. Yeah. Also, update you guys. It was supposed to be 80 degrees and sunny and hot today, and it's literally sky full of clouds and like actually a really comfortable temperature. It kind of worked out great because we're not like sweating and like annoyed. It's kind of a great temperature to really garden. Is. Yeah. And it's going to rain the next two days, so I don't have to water. <laughs> oh, God, already. <laughs> oh, and I got what? Plant. Oh. You're already ready for that? Man, you quick. I think so. Um, I got basil and oregano too, and the basil smells so good. I can't wait to cook with that. I gotta make this nice too. Okay, progress update. Um, bad news. <laughs> we put down some fresh dirt here and went to start planting. And we went to put this like pole thing into the dirt. There is a slab of concrete under all of this dirt right here. So we can't plant. If we're gonna plant, they have to be in pots because it's literally like two inches down is just a slab of concrete. I don't know why they had it as if it was like a garden. So um, we'll have to get more pots and put plants like that there. But we are pivoting because now we can't plant there, which is fine. Um, so now we're planting stuff in the other one. We're doing the hostas over here and then some little plants. Come on. Okay. And then also gonna get this freshened up too for the herbs. And yeah, that's all I have right now. I'll update you guys when we get the uh, palms starting to go. Ouch. Okay. You guys are recording? Yeah, we're good. All right. Oh, your lighting is. Okay, there we go. We're planting the basil and the oregano. Put some raised bed soil in here like this and you gotta like break it up right that's how I remember you gotta like break up the root so that it attaches so you break oh my god it smells so good right mom you break up the root so that it attaches okay so then you bury it in there yeah I love that it's getting hot now and there's hair in my mouth Oh, we should have a, a cocktail popsicle. Do it. I'm down. All right, I'm gonna put my oregano over here. Turn you guys. Okay. I love this glove trick. Right? Yeah. It's great for filming. So through that, okay. you're, you're gonna get dirty in here. Yeah. Oregano. I want to get thyme too, but they didn't have it. Do you want? Um, you're gonna give me the little spatula. You know the little. Did I leave it over there? The shovel? Yeah, that's yeah. what I'm trying to say. <laughs> There's earwigs everywhere. Basil and oregano! Look at her! I gotta make it part of my routine to come out here and water. Water. And then. I think you take I have my little signs. Updates. We repurposed the pots that the palm tree leaves came in. And we used them over here since we can't plant in the ground. And now I'm gonna put some mulch all around it. We put the pink ones in this little hanging thing here. Up here we put the palm tree, which looks so cute. And then we put the orange ones here. These are actually so neon. I didn't even realize until they were here, but look at that. Looks cute. I already had this pot from the apartment. And then. Just put the other palm tree there, two of them. Oh, two palm trees up here. I gotta have it even this. Even this. My maybe. I think it'll look pretty. It'll look a little oasis. And you got one yeah. over there. Yeah, you got maybe. All these trees here. Right. We don't really need it down here. I could probably bring that up. Are you sure? Yeah. Um, I'm gonna put the mulch down here first, though. And then we'll do the other palm tree. And then we're thinking maybe we'll take another ride later and get um, tomorrow, nothing really. 
Um, we want to relax for a little though after we're done, but we need a little more dirt and maybe like one more pot. We have an extra flower here. We can do another little pot. We'll see. Oh, and there's extra flowers over there too. So that's that. Let's put down a bag of mulch. We'll do a transition since I can't edit and do a um, little montage. One, two, three. Okay, how did that work? No edits. <laughs> it looks not that different, but it looks good. It looks better. More like even layer of color. All right, moving on. We're nearing the end. Mom and I can't wait to lay on these lounge chairs and read our book. We, I have her reading It Ends With Us, and I'm reading, um, what am I reading right now? Heartbones. Alrighty, I come to bring you guys the final update. We've got that one planted over there. We've got one on this side. We've got one on this side. We've got a plant over here. DIY dad is here now. I just broke the hose, the hose nozzle. My bad. It was hard to freight. It was like five bucks. It's fine. We got that. Look how cute. We did all the mulch. Got all this planted. It looks pretty good. And then here's what we ended up doing over here. Got the three little pots. <laughs> I showed you guys this already. And then that hanging one. And then that one up there. And then we had actually a few leftover flowers, so we put them in the front of the house too. And we had extra mulch, so we did good. We did good. Now I just wanna put a few hostas in the front and then everything's good. And now we got a new hose. So we're gonna switch out the hose from this old one. Zane and I got a retractable one from Home Depot. So let's see here. Put it in here. Right here she is. Dad loves this stuff. Oh, you mean you got a squishy one? I, I got a squishy one. Yeah, squishy. It's not retractable. Retractable, like it, it sink, it like shrinks. Yeah, that's what I meant. <gasps> Look how nice it came with a thing to. <gasps> that's oh, cute. You just broke. Oh, perfect. <laughs> Hopefully, this is better quality than the one from Harbor Freight. How many feet is this? Oh, this one already looks better. Okay, I don't know. I actually don't know her. I think Zane ordered it, to be honest, so. Wow, he did his research on retractable hoses. That looks nice. All right. You had to shut off on the end. So. Oh, we're upgrading. Get this green hose out of here. Did you see the thing I sent you on Instagram of the guy with the big bellies walking around the yard? <laughs> impersonation of like Long Island dads in their yard. Yeah, look over here. I got my asshole on the other side of this fence. He told me he didn't want that color fence. I told him, what does it matter? It's not your fence. <laughs> it's so funny. You have to watch it. I sent it to you on Instagram. Is it turning on? Oh, it's going to blow up. Look at that. It's kind of like creepy, like a snake. I like that it has a thing to hang it on. You can just twist it up there. That's really yeah. cool. Get this toes out of here. <laughs> you guys, look at this. It looks so nice. I didn't even know it came with a little hook thing and the nozzle. 10 out of 10, I'll link it. Look at my mom with her little book. <laughs> I'm so proud of her. She's been got her little swimsuit on. We're gonna hang out by the pool. Yay! Finally, what time is it? 5.15, we need to get some dinner soon. I'm getting hungry. Okay, finally time to chill and relax. I've got on my bathing suit. This is Amazon. So I'll have it on my, well, it should already be on my Amazon store. I'm having a leftover burger taco. I've got my book and mom's already out there. So we're gonna go relax and I've got my sippy. What more do you need? I feel like this bathing suit is like an awkward, like it does it want to be low rise? Does it want to be the height on the sides? Where does she want to go? I think that's good. Okay, hopefully. No edits, so hopefully it is good. All right, gotta make sure 
get everything it's already 5 26 we'll have like a late dinner okay uh, bye <laughs> these are actually so good you guys and i i did so good on the sauce like it really is delicious i didn't think i was going to be like that big a fan i'm like oh i'll just do ketchup and mayo it is worth it it is such a good sauce i'm really enjoying it me and mom are reading but i just wanted to let you know that these came out very delicious like i would make them again for sure Mom just left and I desperately need to get in the shower. I feel so gross after today. I feel like dirty, I feel itchy, I feel sticky, all of the above. So it is time to take a nice shower and start relaxing for the night. It's like seven o'clock already. So take a nice shower. I think we're gonna do it simple tonight for dinner. Have some soup, like either like ramen or something like that and call it a night. All right out of the shower you guys it is almost eight o'clock it's like 7 55 and it's still light out like the sun is just setting now which is so exciting it feels like it's actually summer beginning um just brushing out my hair i need to put on some face tanner because girl is looking a little pale and then we're gonna make a little food i usually do my tanning drops but two reasons number one I ran out and there's another bottle, but they're downstairs, so I'm not going to get them right now. And number two, I'm gonna use mousse because why not have like a little glow right now because I'm feeling quite pale and I want to feel a little bit better instantly and the drops develop like overnight. So I need a little something, so I'm gonna look a little crazy for a minute. Like I have a dirty face, but it's part of the process. Costco ramen is in the microwave. It's the frozen one with the chicken. It's so good and it just sounds so good right now. I am just putting away the dishes from the dishwasher because we compiled some dishes to put in the dishwasher and that's when it just becomes like a disaster. So if I just quickly put these dishes away, then it won't pile up, you know what I mean? So I'm just doing that right now and just having a chill night. Today was a lot and tomorrow's kind of back more to like regular routine and reality. Um, have to work out, have to upload my vlog. Zane and I have to make a run to Costco because we decided today that we are gonna host a Father's Day brunch with my dad and his stepdad. And then we have plans later on with more parts of the family. So we have to grab like some eggs, bacon. I also just went ahead on Amazon and ordered a pancake dispenser because I wanna do like a brunch on the Blackstone. That's my plan so i'm like do eggs bacon pancakes and then i'm like and some of the pancakes i'll put chocolate chips i'll put like fresh blueberries strawberries and when we have um we already have it uh, like fresh syrup so that'll be really good but i was like you know what make it really nice and easy and fancy a pancake dispenser so i just amazon to that <laughs> basically you like hit the little button and then pancakes just perfectly come out so i don't usually make pancakes so i'm like whatever makes it easier and makes them come out better i'm gonna go for that and i'm just picturing myself with a little ladle and it like spilling all over and whatever so i'm like that will be perfect so excited for that um and i'm gonna start a new vlog tomorrow too what else do we have going on looking at my list for tomorrow i already need it oh and the burgers that i cooked today i want to post the reel for that tomorrow i have to edit that and post it and we've got a brand deal to film tomorrow. So we've got things to do. People to see things to do. But today was so much fun. The backyard looks so cute. It was a lot of work, but it was worth it. And now I tried to make sure I keep up with watering all of the plants and they won't die, right? My mom was like, just make sure you water them like every other day. And I won't do it during the day because I know that like kills your plants and your grass when you do it when the sun is out. So. I'll do it like in the evening time and I think I'll be able to keep up with everything. Oh, especially since we set up the new hose, it's so convenient and nice now. I think I'll be fine. So this is a um, mission. Have Alyssa keep her plants alive this year because I've never had this many. I've usually only done like the ones, like the big palm leaves and the big like um, planters. I've never really done like the little 
little guys so i'm just nervous to keep them alive but i'm gonna try my best and i want to get a few more herbs for my garden too but it just looks so nice out there it's so peaceful and i feel like it completed like the backyard um because other than that that's kind of really all i want to do in the back corner where we put one of those like in the back corner of the pool where we put the palm leaf i'm thinking like a nice like day bed over there kind of situation but also it's kind of like far from everything else so who's gonna go sit over there we'll see i'll have to like think about it but yeah okay my soup is done so i'm gonna finish this dishwasher really quick so i can relax and eat my soup okay we've got the setup the soup so far i took a bite it's amazing i was gonna read my book i've got the sippy i'm gonna get cozy on the couch with my bailey <laughs> i got my blankie and then i was like you know what the new season of love island uk has recently started and i'm kind of tempted and i'm like i read a lot today and i'm just feeling tv vibes which is just so weird because usually i'm like no i need to read my book to be honest i'm not super duper into heart bones i think it's a good book i think all of her books are good but it's not something that I'm like, oh, I can't wait to finish it, but I'm interested in it. But like, also Love Island, and it's been a hot minute since I've been like really into Love Island. It's my favorite reality love show, and there's a new uh, season, so might as well, you know, get started on it. And just like relaxing on the couch and just watching TV, it just sounds really nice right now. So we are getting cozy. <gasps> I probably won't even make it through one episode without falling asleep. Okay, maybe one episode and then I'll probably be done. But I'm excited. Um, and that's going to be the rest of my night. I hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with me today. It was very fun-filled. Um, I was going to say something and I can't remember right now. So hold on, I'm going to pause this so I'm not sitting in silence. I remember. I was going to say um, Zane's watching something right now. But once he's done, uh, I mean, I'm getting into this. So maybe not. Maybe another day. But... I don't know if you guys have ever heard of the show Jury Duty. I've been hearing a lot about it, like, through a bunch of different people, and apparently it's, like, really funny. So I think that's something that Zane and I can watch together. But for now, I'm going to get into Love Island, but I'm curious to watch that as well. That's, like, a random thought. I don't know why that crossed my mind. But anyways, I'm going to end this vlog. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. I'm going to pick up a weekend vlog tomorrow. It's going to be nice and relaxing. Um father's day and i already told you what i got going on tomorrow and i just can't wait to eat and watch tv so i love you guys so much thank you so much for watching and i'll see you all next time bye guys